Today I'm going to model a table in FreeCAD and then construct the table as well. So first thing is to create a new workspace. So once you create that, you go to preferences, you go to units and make sure the units are in Imperial. So I'm going to use the US system here and I'm going to make the decimal places three. It doesn't really matter, but uh, you want to do that. Um, then uh, next thing is to create the workspace, uh, the coordinate system. So coordinate system would give you the space you are going to utilize to create your uh, components of the table. So first thing is now is to create the uh, a cube. I'm going to create the table top first. So um, in order to do that, I'm going to give some dimensions, length, width, and some height. Uh, so let's enter those numbers here. Uh, so 0.75 for the height. That's the thickness of the uh, sheet, plywood sheet I'm going to use for the table. So that's created. Uh, you can see that it's hang on the coordinate system, which is, it's actually created at uh, uh, 0, 0, 0 uh, coordinates. Now I renamed the table as it has a table top. So now I'm going to create the skirts, both the long side as well as the short side uh, skirts. So let's create the long side first here. Uh, so all these dimensions, I already come up, uh, came up with them designing uh, the table. So I'm just going to enter them uh, for this video. So in order to you know keep the video short. Um, so now I have created the uh, long side skirt now um, I'm going to position it the way I want it. So I think I got it where I want the uh, skirt to be. It's symmetric along the uh, the long side, and I'm going to rename it. Say let's say uh, long skirt. So long side skirt. So let's rename that. Now I'm going to create another cube and now I'm going to create the short side skirt. So the, uh, the cube is already created. It, it will always created at the uh, coordinate 0, 0, 0. So I'm going to just uh, give some dimensions to that. Um, Let's do that now. Okay, it's done. Now I need to position that. So you're going to use the position. Uh, so I'm going to change the X. I need to move it a little bit forward. Okay, do that. I'm going to also move it a little bit uh, in the Y direction to get it to the right location. So let's do that. So we got those and we got it at the right location. Rename it. Say, let's say short side skirt. So we got the both the skirts done. Uh, now I think I want to create a, a leg, the table leg. Uh, so I'm going to position it at uh, the appropriate location. I'll start with the same method I have I used before, which is creating a cube at, uh, at the origin and then give some dimensions to that and then position it. So let's do that. Uh, let's create another cube. Give some dimensions to the, uh, the table leg.
so the now the you can see the leg is created now I need to position it uh, in between the sh short and the long skirt so go position it so we got the leg at the right location now all I have to do is to duplicate the one the models or the the uh, components I created to create the rest of the table so let's copy you can use the copy command to do that um, so let's copy the um, long sides skirt first and then uh, position it and then uh, you can create uh, copy and position the rest of the uh, components yeah so copy and now you have to go and uh, paste it so in order to do that you have to go to edit So edit on the edit you have paste so once you paste it um, it is uh, already created but it is created on top of the uh, the original skirt so now once you pick the the skirt uh, you want to move from the tree you have to use the dimensions or the coordinates of the position and now you can position it so I think I need to change it a little bit on the Y so now it's 22.25 and that will get it exactly where I want it now I'm going to do the same for the other skirt copy and paste now you have to position it Yeah, so you can come over there and give the dimensions. Okay, you got that done. Now you have to create the le other three legs. So you can create a four leg table. So uh, I'm going to it's the same procedure you're going to copy and paste and position so i'm going to play the video a little bit faster here because it's the same uh, as before so we, we're going to go a little bit faster and complete the table so all three all three legs are created now you need to position them And the leg on the opposite side now you're going to go to the other one position it on the uh, right location and then you're going to go for the last leg and position it as well so you got the table done now so it's so you can move rotate and look at it so the table is pretty much done 
so now you have to go and save it and you have to construct it so i use some uh, some uh, old tv stand plywood from that so and then some uh, three by two studs uh, and then finally created the table